Brentech, yeah, where tech is made simple. So Mozilla has rolled out another bug fix update for version 105, which is the latest stable release. And version 105 um, was released about uh, two weeks ago. And um, this latest bug fix update um, has rolled out on the 7th of October, late yesterday in my region. And it seems that version 105 has been plagued with a lot of issues as this is now the third bug fix update that has rolled out since that release of 105 about two weeks ago. Now, um, at first, just to double check, you have this update. Just head to your menu as always, help, about Firefox. And the latest version in build now is 105.0.3. It's the third point release that uh, 105 has received as mentioned. Now, if you are using a VAST or AVG antivirus software, then this um, bug fix update is addressing an issue for users using those two antivirus products, um, mainly, mainly with older versions of Avast or, and or AVG antivirus software. And Mozilla has had a lot of user feedback for users of those um, antivirus products where um, the Firefox web browser was crashing. So um, this latest bug fix update now, once and for all, according to Mozilla now, um, mitigates and resolves that issue. And the release notes say mitigated frequent crashes for Windows users with a vast or AVG antivirus software installed. So that bug has now been fixed. And um, so if you are running a, a vast or AVG antivirus software, um, you may want to update your web browser as mentioned sooner than later. And also, you also want to check that your antivirus software is up to date um, because, as mentioned, uh, this issue has been caused mainly by older versions of those products. So just check that's also up to date. So just double check Firefox and your antivirus software is up to date. And as mentioned, this latest bug fix now, um, as they have said in the release notes, mitigates frequent crashes for Windows users using those two antivirus products. And as always, um, if you want to head to the release notes where you can just get a little bit more information, you can just click on what's new. And then you can also look at the bug report, which will give you a little bit more info if interested. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.